So here's the service elevator. It's rest for some reason. It's already called. Here's a passenger one, which is already parked in here. Hear the wind coming from here. It's the best thing of these. I'll do this with the open door. And here we come. Less luxurious cab. So it's just straight up steel. It's a bit darker. In very good shape for a service elevator. So the door is a little bit scratched, but that's what you expect. Let's move doors too. stops flash indicator it goes out too and here's the door opening mechanism which unlocks the outer doors and then travel and there is the other elevator too but there is no view up here uh, so you can see a bit of the shaft and if all you can see the cable is going up to the bottom room too so i'm going to show how that thing there over works uh -huh. let's go to press down to as on this one has alarm written full instead of a yell. You know what the key switch is, can be a million things. And the greater is. Yeah. Oh, this is awesome. Motor is original, controller is original. As you can see by the flashing floor number. Here's the cab, it's all steel, which is more than suitable for service. Yeah, so emergency light, the camera, and the ceiling. Door operator too is the same as these auto Otis has. Oh, of course not original. Oh, that's why it looks a lot less, probably it's more smooth of a motor. And oh, let me say it again. So, oh, the door stays in place. And you. Oh, didn't know that they done that. See, the arrow already lights up. And well, that's it. Yeah, the on the ground floor in the lobby above it has the indicator. On the other floors, it's just a little light. But yes, it's working nicely. Doors original. I think only on this the ground floor too, its doors are at beach. But overall very nice passenger service. It's very well maintained. Thankfully they haven't gone to any generic maintenance. But yes. And here we are, the only building in this town. And for a long time the only elevators. And that's it.